When teas first originally started being sold, it was sold in the bags. You were supposed to take it out of the bags and put it right in the tea, but they found it was easier just to dip the tea in the, the bag in the, the hot water and bam, you got some tea. Some smart people out there, smarter than this guy. They're dirty. Dirty, dirty, dirty glasses. Today we got Dubrois, Dubrois, Duclaw Brewing Company, the Pastriarchy, Imperial Almond, and I'm getting ahead of myself, Almond and Brittle Imperial Stout, 8.3% alcohol, Maryland made, handcrafted, 16 ounces, that's why I got my big glass, Craving Caramel, yeah, you know I like turtles, those turtles, those little pecan, pecan things, go to DuclawBrewing.com, and if, you go, if you're going over there, it says 20th in limited release, Edition number 20. If you're going to Duclaw.com, put them over here too. Check them out. Give them a look see. <coughs> ah. All right. I had to get my big glass. Hey, is that, is that cracked? No, it didn't crack. It looks like it's cracked, but it's the way it's cut. Someone did it wrong. Yep, I did it wrong. All right, very, very dark as you would expect. Imperial Stouts are just, I don't know why they, they're higher in alcohol. Is that why they're called Imperial? After so much of an inc increase in alcohol, it's like 8.3? When does it not become Imperial? Eight? 8.2? I don't know. Very dark head, tight bubbles, big ones in the middle. Not going down very, you can't see a jet. You couldn't see the sun through there. They, they have, isn't there something supposed to be going toward the sun or something like that? I don't know. Probably just land right on it and just, you know, take some pictures and take off. Very chocolatey. Malty, they, you would imagine. Let's try this kick in the pants. Mm. Very thick, malty. Mm. Now, Give me brittle. You know, it just tastes like a thick ass beer. Very thick. Very man. Wow. This is a dessert beer. It's something after you have dessert. Have another one. No, just this is something. Yeah, you sip on it. Sit on the porch. Watch the cars go by. And take your time. And. Did you know, do you ever notice when you're watching like uh, surfing movies and stuff, you see the guys on there waxing their surfboard, waxing their surfboard. We used to do that when we used to be growing up, you get canning wax and you would rub it all over the bottom of the inner tube and it would you'd go down to the slope faster. Well, I always wondered what, what were they doing that for? Why were they putting that on there? Does it go across the water? Here it, it's waterproof. It, it's on the upside, so their feet stick to it, so they don't slide off. <laughs> when I heard that, I was, it was amazing. I'd never known that before. I was like, I was telling everybody. They didn't know. You probably already knew that. So, this is a very thick beer, and it's very good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Did you know Wonder Woman? had a black sister. Her name was Nubia. She was carved from black clay, sculpted from black clay, not carved, but sculpted from black clay, where woman, Wonder Woman was sculpted from white clay. That's, that's weird. Got some lacing going on. Surprised I knew that word, did you? There you go. It's pretty good. I thought this was out of Cleveland, and they do a, a bunch of odd things that some of them I just don't care. But Unicorn Farts, that beer, that was just kind of stupid to put that thing out there. But anyways, if you have a goldfish and you put it in a dark room long enough, it will turn white. The same thing is there's a uh, we have a reservoir where we get our water. Communities get their water from, and there's a bridge that's like. Uh, 40, 50 feet above it. And we used to go there and throw bread 
and bluegills, just tons of bluegills come in there. Sometimes you get a big old carp, and some of these carp, 15, 20 pounds, they're big. You could see them out there, and they're white. And I'm thinking they're down deep in the water on the bottom, and light doesn't get down there very often, and they turn white, and they come up, and man, big, big dang carp. Huge dang things. And I actually have a video of some friends jumping off that bridge. I know it's illegal as hell, but they jumped off of there, and they swam to shore. I told him, I said, man, you don't want to be jumping out that far, you ain't going to make it. And one guy almost didn't make it. And like two weeks later, some other kids did it at nighttime, one drowned. All right, that's a very sipping beer, man. That's no joke, man. That's a nice, good, it's very good. It's got the dark, it's like a dark chocolate, too. I like the bitter. It, it, it is bitter, very bitter but it's still sweet, and it's really good. I'm gonna take me five minutes to drink this. It's way more than normal. No, it'll take a little bit longer than that. So, give this give this a try if you can get it in your area. And, uh, yeah, Maryland. See, I wonder how far these companies ship their stuff. Maryland, okay, we're over in Ohio. I'm, I'm like, next to PA, about 10 minutes away from PA. So I, I don't know how far they ship out. You know, do they ship it all the way down south? You know, I, I don't know. They probably will. I mean, you can get any beer anywhere, but if they have to order it and distribute it and everything, I don't know. So there you go. And for the last one, 27,000 trees are cut down every day. For what? You're right. Toilet paper. Cheers.